Hello and welcome back to lesson of the week. Wow, time sure flies so fast because we are already on episode eighteen, and this time I am bringing you twins to the ears. Now you might be wondering why twins to the ears but not the eyes. Well, let's have a look at what this means. Over here we have the word homophones. Look at the word phones. It may remind you of your telephone, which is what you use to call someone and hear their voice. Homophones are basically words that sound the same but have different spellings. So when you hear the word, they tend to sound the same, but they're not the same words. Let's have a look at the first pair. Now over here we have the word two and two. Two and two sounds the same, but do notice that they are spelt differently. So for two, it means reaching a point. The car goes from Putrajaya to KL, while two is the number. I have two cats. So again, we can see that they sound the same. But the spelling is different. Next, we have heart and heart. Now, this may sound slightly different, especially if your friend pronounces the D in heart and the T in heart loudly. But if they don't, then they might sound slightly the same. Hard means not easy. It is hard to think when there are a lot of things to do, and heart. Stands for the organ. I exercise every day to keep my heart healthy. Now moving on to the next pair, we have red and red. For this case, red is the past tense of read. Past tense means words that has happened in the past. She read a book last night. This girl has read a book. The night before, so we use red. On the right side, we can see the color red. My favorite color is red. So let's try putting it both words in a sentence. I read a story about the little red riding hood yesterday. Can you see the difference? You can't, but you know now that red and red are two different words. Moving on to the next pair, we have accept and accept. Accept means you agree. You say yes to something. You agree to take it. Now, if you're signing up for a social media like Instagram, you might have to agree to the terms and conditions. So when you agree, you accept the terms and conditions. On the other hand, accept means Not included. The arrows are pointing one way, except for one. We can see that the big arrow is pointing to the right, while the small arrows are pointing to the left. So, trying to put it into a sentence, I accept the terms and condition, except for one. Now, for the next one, we have tail and tail. One tail. Is the long, swishy organ at the back of an animal. So if you have seen a cat or a dog, then you might have seen their tails. The dog is wagging its tail excitedly, while the other tail is story, like fairy tail. The tail is about a magical castle with dragons. Can you come up with a sentence using these two words? Please try. That is all for this week's lesson. Don't miss out on the new videos by clicking subscribe at our channel, like, and don't forget to share to your friends. See you soon.